Hey, hey everyone, Angela O'Hare here, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. I'm doing another new construction final walkthrough. Today I'm over here at the McCulley, which is a Lennar community close to Cadence. It's not part of Cadence, but it's really close to Cadence and next door to a community called Tuscany. So this is a Lennar community, the McCulley. We're looking at the Sage model with the next gen suite, which is pretty cool. I love Lennar when they do their next gen suites. This home has four bedrooms, three and a half baths, three car garage, and 30, 72 square feet. It's a beauty, large home. Now, when you buy new construction, your home's front yard is already going to come landscaped and most of the builders now are doing pavers which is beautiful so the thing I like about the next gen suites is you could use this the third car garage for the next gen because there's also access to the front door which will look but there's also the side door right here we'll go all the way around in a minute fully finished garage, water heater, plumb for a water softener. You know, the traditional garage stuff, right? I mean, you've seen one, you've seen it all for your fire sprinklers. We'll do the outside first because my clients are still inside finishing up with the dude. I like this aspect though right here for the next gen suite they have their own door decent sized yard it's big enough to put a pool with a covered patio and then they also have a balcony upstairs and actually Right behind them is that Tuscany community in Henderson. This is my second, well, this month, second new construction closing in Henderson. I am have one closing in Cadence. Don't sell much in Henderson, but I still sell there. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's go take a look through the front door. It's a nice community. It is cold out today. I should be home being lazy, laying in bed and cuddling with all my animals. Just kidding. <laughs> I like this entryway too. Now when you buy with Lennar, Lennar has this thing, this thing called everything included package. So the nice thing about this home is that it comes with the blinds the refrigerator, the washer and dryer, all of that is already included as part of the everything included. And it's also a smart home, has the ring doorbell, everything in this house is smart. And here is the main living area. We will look at the next gen suite, head upstairs, and then we'll come back downstairs and take a look. So here is the, one of the half baths. The nice thing with Lennar that this is, um, this is a cultured marble, but these cabinets came as part of the house. They did spend extra money on the wood-like tile flooring, which is really nice. And this is the next gen suite which is very good size, it has the smart tubing. And this also comes with a refrigerator. It's gonna come with a microwave, it's just back ordered. I mean, this is a cute little kitchenette. And then here's the front door for the next gen suite. Lots of blue tape, so when we do final walkthrough, we just come through and make sure that um, there's no issues. So apparently they went blue tape happy here. <laughs> but this is a nice, you know, generic 
builder grade insert, but I mean, it suits its purpose, especially with it being just the next gen suite. Now in the next gen suite, you're gonna have a primary room as well. Um, and all the rooms come with the smart tubing. It's a decent size. Now the only thing we had concerns with was this thing. The next gen suites come with their own washer and dryer, but look how tacky this looks in this closet. Most of the Lenore homes that I've seen in Summerlin with the next gen suite, they have a separate closet just for that. So this is kind of a little upsetting right now to my clients, which I don't blame them of how that washer and dryer, stack washer and dryer is located. They should have made a separate room for it. It's a little cloudy out. Sorry if you can't see very well. Okay, so now we're gonna head upstairs before we finish up with the downstairs. So I like, again, they have the wide plank tile, wood-like tile flooring, and then they went with the vinyl plank flooring for the rest of upstairs and the stairs, which is nice, especially if you have any animals. It's easy to maintain. Vinyl plank flooring is very popular right now, but I really, really like this model. It's a great size home because now when you come up the stairs, you have another living quarters. You have a huge loft area. And I like how all the rooms have that smart tubing. And then here's the primary bedroom. It's a very good size. The nice thing is, I mean, you get peaky boo views of the mountains, but it's still beautiful out, even though it's overcast today. And you see all your neighbors, but hey, if you're sitting in a chair, you're just gonna see a little, little mountains. And that right there is Tuscany, which is a golf course community. And then here is the primary toilet. And then the primary bathroom, they didn't go with any upgrades. They just went with the basic builder inserts, fiberglass, and then the cultured marble, which looks very nice, white, clean, simple, and then the nice light gray shaker cabinets. And then the master closet is humongous. I like the texture on the walls here. It's very nice. You can tell typically when it's a Pulte home by the texture of the walls. I don't see too many builders doing that type of texture. And I like that everything included, the washer and dryer came with this house, the refrigerator came with this house, but the nice feature about this laundry room is, ta-da! This huge linen closet. It's like it could be a nursery. <laughs> Just kidding. And then your smart panel up here in the laundry room. Let's go into bedroom number three. Good size room, so probably maybe 12 by 12. Typical size rooms. with a nice double vanity. It's a good size secondary bathroom. And again, they just went with the builder inserts for the bathroom, which if it were me, that's what I would do in all my secondary bathrooms. 
I would have maybe upgraded the primary, but typically with Lennar, it's usually harder to do a lot of those additional upgrades. You can upgrade the flooring and maybe the countertops and the backsplash. And this one has a nice walk-in closet. So we'll go take a look of downstairs finally and then wrap this tour up. Let me know in the comments what you think of this home, if you like it or not, and be sure to subscribe. I forgot to ask for that in the beginning of this video. Okay, so now here's the great room. You could probably make this like your dining room because there's a pendant for a lighting that could be there. And then you have this big great room and the kitchen, which is beautiful. We'll get into that in a minute. Let's just do a complete 360, 380, whatever. And the nice thing, like I said, with buying Lennar Homes is the everything included package. You don't have to spend money extra money for blinds because it comes with the home all the smart tubing they have the ring doorbell and again all the appliances are included which are the fridge and washer and dryer which is really nice so the only updates that they spent on this home or upgrades i should say was the flooring the countertops and the backsplash so this home came with this beautiful light gray shaker style cabinets and it's a very big kitchen, very good sized island with the sink in the middle. And then a beautiful gray quartz countertops with the honeycomb tile backsplash. The oven and the fridge came with it, which is lovely. And then the pantry is a decent size. I mean, it's a pantry. Let me know in the comments what you think of this model over here at Macaulay. The Macaulay is what it's called. Just to surmise, this is the Sage model with the next gen. It's around 3,072 square feet with four bedrooms, three and a half baths, and a two car garage. If you're thinking about buying new construction here in the Las Vegas Valley, including Henderson and North Las Vegas. I am your new home expert. You can always give me a call at 702-370-5112. Be sure to hit that like button, subscribe button, and I'll see you guys on the next one.